Good morning and welcome to Daily Disciplines. Today we move from Anonymous, one of the most prolific writers that's ever lived, <laughs> to a man that many of you would be familiar with, I think, and by the name of Sir Isaac Newton. Now Anonymous said this, this is very interesting. I've always wanted to be able to procrastinate, but somehow I've just never gotten around to it. <laughs> and Isaac Newton said, a body at rest stays at rest. A body in motion stays in motion. So today we want to talk about what is the definition of procrastination. Many people have made comments about it, and there are some quotes that I think are helpful in our understanding of not only our own procrastination, but that of others and how they think about it, how they experience it. My, again, my observation of life over these many years is that if I can learn something from someone else's experience, it saves me a lot of time, a lot of energy, oftentimes a lot of pain, and it's a better way to learn many things in life. Some of them can be learned, of course, only by personal experience, but I believe the lessons about procrastination can be learned from others. And so their understanding of procrastination and what it is and how it works is helpful and instructive to us. A man by the name of Dr. Anthony said, waiting is a trap. There will always be reasons to wait. The truth is, there are only two things in life, reasons and results. And reasons simply don't count. So what he points us to in our understanding of what procrastination really is, the definition of procrastination, is that the results are what most people are looking for. The results are what we're looking for in our own lives. One of the most familiar quotes, I think, is from a man by the name of Josh Billings. I didn't realize who said this, but he said, don't put off till tomorrow what can be enjoyed today. Wayne Gretzky, one of the great hockey players of all time, said that procrastination is one of the most common and deadliest of diseases, and its toll on success and happiness is heavy. And someone has said, know the value of time. Snatch, seize, and enjoy every moment of it. No idleness, no laziness, no procrastination. Never put off till tomorrow what you can do today. The word procrastination itself comes from a Latin word, and that's probably not important to you or to me, except it's just been around for a long time. It's said that it was first used in 1548 as a part of a sermon when the minister was preaching one day. So, what is the simple definition? If you look in the, the uh, dictionary, you'll find to put off intentionally the doing of something that should be done, or to postpone or delay needlessly, to put off till another day or time, to defer, to delay. These simple definitions I think we all understand, but let's conclude our time today with this definition. Procrastination is an habitual way of fraudulently justifying to ourselves that a particular endeavor should not, does not need to, or cannot be started now. And because that is the definition, I think we'll find some consequences in later discussion that we don't want to have as a part of our life. So today, get started now. Get in motion and have a great day. We'll talk again soon.